We all know that Adobe Muse is a really great tool to make a website without seeing code. And I'm working now on a website for my field trip with my students for next October. And uh, I would like some uh, animation going on uh, around here. Um, so I went to uh, Adobe Animate CC and I've uh, made this leprechaun move his little eye. He's giving a wink and that's basically all the animation that's in it right now. So it's all vector graphics um, in three layers right now. And I want to export it in a way that Adobe Muse will uh, understand what it's all about. So I'm going to File, Publish Settings, and there you've got the OAM package file. OAM is the file that you need in order to get your animation uh, into Dreamweaver, Muse, Adobe InDesign. It's a really nice uh, format. It's a little archive with all the uh, JavaScript, uh, HTML, uh, images and stuff in it. Um, and packaged in a way that the other tools can understand it. So I'm hitting the OK button. Let's see if it all still works. Oh, there's the blink. Okay, so now I go to publish. And it will create my OEM file. I go to Muse, Command D to place an image or an animation. Here's the Dublin.OAM file. Open it. And I can place it over here. And then let's preview the site. And let's see if the blink still works. There you go. That's how you get an Adobe Animate file within your favorite non-code web design tool. Thank you for watching.